Hey guys, what is up? It is Destiny and I am here again with another video. So today is November 21st, 2020 and I am officially 10 months long. I cannot believe that I've reached 10 months. Like it doesn't seem like I've had my locks for 10 months and my hair has grown so much since I um, got my locks and I'll insert a picture right here so you guys can see what my locks look like when I first started them um, 10 months ago but my hair has gone through so many changes and I'm just so proud of myself for sticking it out and everything like that because y'all um, having locks is not easy it's like having locks is a huge 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 commitment because like once you start your locks that's your foundation for them. It's no turning back unless you comb them out or you cut them off. And with this set of locks, I wanted to keep these. Even though, you know, I've wanted to comb them out at times, I'm just so proud of myself for like thugging it out and keeping them because locks don't happen overnight. It's a journey. You gotta trust the process. And then in the end, everything is gonna turn out good. And I plan on keeping my locks for a long time or till I feel like, you know, time has come for me to move on to a new journey, but I'm in love with my locks. Um, I don't, there's really not that many changes from my nine month lock update. Um, the only thing that's really changes, I'm getting like a lot of length and like, I can like shake my hair because, and also, Another thing that I have noticed um, being 10 months locked is that my hair in the back is getting longer. Like I can like feel the hair. Um, I can feel like my locks like touching kind of my neck. And yeah, I'm still experiencing lint in the bottom locks. It's annoying, but at this point I care, but I don't care, but I'm just ready for my hair to get longer so I can do more things with it um I'm just so happy I'm just so happy like um I don't know if you guys knew or not but I had combined two of my locks it was either two or three months ago and there are two locks in the front and I combined them using the two strand twist method as you can see um the you can still see that strand pattern but it's starting to like dimish so i can like feel it i can still feel like up here i don't feel it but down here i can still like feel that two strand pattern you can still see it a little bit but these are come they're combining well um i still have frizziness but with locks it's gonna take a while for like those loose strands to like pull into the locks so I'm not really tripping about those but my locks are starting to look more like locks um, every single time I do a update and I try to do updates um, every month um, so yeah I want to like give you guys like a 360 of my locks so you guys can see what my locks looking like at 10 months On the next couple clips, y'all probably gonna see lint in my hair, but ignore that because I didn't notice it at first, but I eventually do.
with my 10 month old locks, um, like I said, not too much has changed. Um, I don't, I don't know if I've mentioned in previous videos or not, but sometimes, um, my locks do hurt a little bit if I pull them a certain way, but next time I wash my hair, I think I'm going to do a protein treatment because I haven't had like any type of treatment conditioner in my hair since I stopped going to a loctician. So I think next time that I do my um, wash routine, I'm going to do a pro protein treatment so my locks can get like some elasticity in them or something like that. I don't know. Um, my ends are still ceiling and everything but i'm just really happy with my locks i cannot wait until i can get a ponytail up in this but i just wanted to show you guys my 10 month old locks just wanted to give y'all like an update of my 10 month old locks what my locks is going through so i hope you guys enjoyed this video please make sure you like comment and subscribe for more content and i'll be back with another video very soon bye y'all